Hello, hello, and welcome to another update video about Link. Well, Link is moving very, very slowly uh, higher a little bit, but still overall sideways action. This all looks very, very corrective. Um, quick reminder that uh, I'm still slightly leaning towards the yellow scenario, especially as long as we are below resistance, below the 11.92 level, $12.09 level. These are key targets within the yellow scenario, which is a corrective rally in wave B, which could then result in a C wave to the downside. So I'm still slightly leaning towards that scenario that we could get that one more low in wave C of Z of two. Um, but yeah, I mean, there is no indication at the moment that something more bullish is unfolding. Of course, the, the trend, you could say the trend of the 6th of September low is up, but only very, it's a very weak uptrend. And normally what we say is when it's overlapping messy price action, it's corrective. And especially when we cannot count five wave movements to the upside, but you get all those, all of this stuff, which is overlapping slow, you know, the buyers are selling into the rallies and everything. That's corrective and especially when we then stay still below resistance, we haven't even reached the ideal target of the corrective rally, then yeah, it typically indicates that um, this is at least not clearly bullish. But there are always certain pivots that would tell us when something more bullish is unfolding. There would be a break, for example, above $11.92. So I would need to see a break above $11.92 for a more bullish, let's say for to, to start to lean towards a more bullish scenario. But don't get me wrong, link even if it breaks above that level it still needs to form all five waves as per the white scenario for a clearly bullish let's say confirmation when we get these five waves we can say that on the 5th of august a substantial low formed until then the risk is just very high even you know that this might just even be a, a, a larger corrective rally okay so someone when avex had a similar pattern and avex broke above initial resistance and someone said oh, aren't we bullish now and i said as long as it's a three wave rally, we at least have to be on the side of caution, right? And that's why I always need to see these five waves. And the problem is if the initial rally, which was here unfolding between the 5th of August and the 26th of August, if that rally is only a three wave move and only corrective, then I can't yet be clearly bullish. But we can maybe get a little bit more bullish when we get a break above $12.10. It would definitely open the door to $17.50. But I can tell you that the next resistance then would be at 1471 because that would be the target for an extended X wave, which would then still allow for further downside. So I could see possibly Ethereum doing some something similar like that. Therefore, definitely something to pay attention to. And at the moment, yeah, we might still move a little higher here towards $12.10. But overall, I think that the pressure is still keeping the price down. And yeah, this is just a corrective rally and I assume we are still in the late stages of wave C of B. But as soon as we get above the pivot here at 12.10, $14.72 comes into focus. That's the update about Link. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.